Queen Elizabeth II's legacy in Guinea Farm is criticized by her strong commitment to duty, service and tradition within the context of her role as the Commander-in-Chief of the British Armed Forces. Throughout her reign, she has demonstrated unwavering support for the military and has played a significant role in upholding the monarchy connection with the armed forces. Queen Elizabeth II's presence in military uniform has served as a unifying symbol for the armed forces and the entire nation. Her participation in various military ceremonies, prayers and events has underscored her dedication to the defense and security of the United Kingdom. The Queen's legacy in uniform reflects her personal dedication to the welfare of servicemen and women. She has consistently shown her appreciation for their sacrifices, often visiting military bases, hospitals, and uh, com uh, commemorating fallen soldiers. The genuine concern has um, endeared her to the military community and the public alike. Queen Elizabeth II's role as Commander-in-Chief involves her participation in key ceremonial events such as Trooping the Colors and uh, Remembrance Sunday. These events highlight her connection to the military tradition and her role as a representative of the armed forces. While Queen Elizabeth II holds a deep respect for military tradition, she has also recognized the importance of adopting the modern time. Under her reign, the armed forces have undergone modernization and transformation, reflecting her forward-thinking approach to defense and security. The Queen's appearance in military uniform have also played a role in international diplomacy. Her interaction with foreign leaders and visits to other countries often include military elements, emphasizing the importance of cooperation and diplomacy in global affairs. Queen Elizabeth II legacy extends to her support for veterans and their families. Her involvement with organizations dedicated to the well-being of veterans showcases her commitment to recognize their contribution beyond their years of service. At short, uh, Queen Elizabeth II's legacy in uniform is marked by her steadfast dedication to the British Armed Forces, her uh, embodiment of tradition and continuity, and her recognition of the involving nature of defense and security. Her role as Commander-in-Chief has not only strengthened the ties between the monarchy and the military, but also underscored the values of duty, service, and unity that are essential for a strong and resilient nation. So, my dear friends, if you like our ideas, Click the like button and subscribe our channel.